Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Dot to you, Volume 3 Redemption. I'm Kaito Yahiko, and in the last episode we... I don't remember. <laughs> we did stuff, and in this episode I think we're gonna go fight and Terrence? Yes? No? Maybe? I'm not sure. We're doing something, and it's fighting. I think it's Aunt Terrence, isn't it? Let's see how well I live. It's a good test of livability. Whatever. Is this the first time I've recorded this with this mic? I'm not sure. If it is, I got a new mic. Blue Snowball. If it isn't, then you've already heard this and ignore me. Uh, I also recently got a new phone. My old phone, it was a it was HTC Aria, and then we switched to Sprint. And now I've got a... Uh, oh, the controller shrieked out at me. I didn't want to stay able to walk over there. Uh, and now I've got a Samsung Galaxy S3. Is awesome. So Antares is our opponent for the semifinals. Well, couldn't we just ask Antares to forfeit the match? No way. That single-minded old geezer's gotten more stubborn than ever. It doesn't look like he plans to go easy on us. We've got to meet him full on. It's just about time. Let's. Oh shit, Terrence. sorry about that. That was I'm not fighting to try and defeat you. That was next. I didn't mean to skip Coon there. Sorry, Coon. It's to protect you. I just I can't let you fight the infected players. Woo! Now the semifinals! It's Team Haseo versus Team and Terrence! Arena fans know all too well. This battle is between Master and Apprentice. And once again, we hear the now familiar boos for Team Haseo. To be perfectly frank, ladies and gentlemen, I cannot help but feel a small pang of sympathy for Haseo and his team. Screw you, audience. I don't need your support to win this. Come here, Antares. Ouch. Oh, hit him. It wasn't me. It must have been cool. I was being attacked, I did, so I couldn't use my skill trigger. Because I was being attacked, I did. I wonder what weapon is best to use against Antares. I don't even know. I guess it doesn't matter. Cool, I'm gonna go ahead and go with the dual blades then. Just cause I like it. Better. Come here, Antares, I just wanna play! It's, come on, it's just a friendly... Ouch. Playing with the... Master and the Apprentice or whatever, even though I don't think you really taught me all that much. But, you know, whatever. I didn't mean to do that. That's okay. That's actually fine. I didn't get countered, so it's okay. What count? What, no, I guess I have the after awakening. Cool. I wasn't sure, actually. Because I changed it to beast awakening when there's nobody in my team and I'm like alone and we only have one other person, so. Cool. I need to level this up more. I need to use it like so much more. Get it all leveled up. I don't want to screw you, Daikon. Mmm. Sucks for you guys. Damn it, Antares, don't block. I was gonna do that. Beat me to it. Your attack is such a weird, like, stopping point there that I was able to block in the middle of your attack. It's weird. It's like you do the first strike and then you don't, and then you, like, 
stop for a second and then I can hit you. Whatever. Almost got him back. Well, I'd say it's about half, actually. Go with Warwell. I don't want to waste all of my SP too quickly. Man, Tez. Why are you doing this so often? Okay. Miles up again. Let's just go ahead and uh, use it again. Not like I'm gonna need anything else to battle. All this is all I need it for. Let's just skip it again, because. In the interest of saving time. Well, we killed one of their dudes. Antares, I killed your teammate. He's dead. Oh. He doesn't flinchy flinch, it's not fair. I like whirlwind. I wonder what I get after Ghost Falcon. See, he had a weird pause, like after his first strike, and if you got hit by the first strike, you could easily block the second one. Come here, Antares. This is such riveting commentary. I really have no idea what to say. Uh, my phone is awesome. I love it. It's so pretty. Like, it's got... The screen is so nice on this thing. And then it's fast. It's much faster than my previous phone. My previous phone was like two years old though, so it's probably just got slower with age and shits. I don't know. I don't know if phones are the same as computers and the longer you have them, the worse they get. Because the phones I had before, I, that was my first smartphone. All the phones I had before my HTC Aria was just you know, flip phones or slide phones that didn't really have anything on them. They weren't smartphones, they weren't Androids, they weren't Blackberries, they weren't iOS. Just a phone. You done yet? How far are you? How close? How close? Oh, you're almost done. I bet one more awakening will kill you, but... Somebody healed you. Did you heal you or did your teammate heal you? Let's go ahead and go with just power. With one less teammate, it should be easier to hit him with this thing. Well, let's switch him out. I don't even care. Oh, uh, 1 HP. Did it purposely. S yeah, I can't move. Okay. You know there's no way I could have let you win. To protect me, you mean? <sighs> I appreciate it. Thanks. Now, that won't do, Terror of Death. We can't have anyone throwing a match now, can we? It's quite a shame to see you've brought your personal feelings into the arena. <sighs> You think he threw the match? Dear friends, as you are aware, Antares and Haseo are master and student, and there seems to be a chance that Antares purposefully lost this battle in order to allow Haseo to advance. The bastard threw the fight! That's cheating! <laughs> Silence! You dare dishonor our honorable match? Honorable match, hmm? You must be joking. For now, Antares, we'll have the loser take his lead. Haseo was suspected of cheating in the previous tournament. He used a power that deviates from the system. He entered this tournament with a hacked PC. Oh yeah? Where's your proof? 
Right here, of course. <laughs> what is that monster? I've never seen anything like that. That's... Is that an image Yata saved with the Serpent of Lore? <laughs> There'll be no more trickery from you, Terror of Death. Damn it. Everyone! Haseo used a hacked PC to become Emperor of the Demon Palace and the Holy Palace! What the hell? No way! But wait! I have further charges against Haseo! There have been many disturbing reports of impossible situations and phenomena in the world of late. Furthermore, all of these abnormalities were caused by the dangerous elements that call themselves the GU. Could there be any greater offense to honest players like ourselves who work diligently to make ourselves better? Get lost, you cheaters! Don't dirty up the world! Seek your wise, fair, and honest judgment. Is Haseo guilty? Or is he innocent? Yes, I see your opinion. Haseo's terrible guilt. Runs deep. I disqualify you and banish you from the Colosseum as well as the world. Get out, Haseo! Get lost, Haseo! Bastard! <laughs> yes, howl at me, you trash. I swear to you, I'll make you eat those words. What a fool you are, terror of death. Have you not realized yet? Your precious ideals no longer exist anywhere in this world. The mass opinion of the players at large decides what qualifies as right and wrong in the world now. Your heinous sin will be carved into the logs of the world for all eternity! May your life be miserable. May you be crushed under the pangs of your guilt! Wait a moment. Tayaku! Entrance! Sakubo! <laughs> you got scared, didn't you, Haseo? What? What are you guys doing with Taihaku? You shouldn't have counted on me and Master Ren. Always doing exactly what you told us to do. Right? 
right, Master Ren? <laughs> Me and Master Ren are going off on our own now, and no one can stop us. But... Why? Why would you side with Taihaku and with Sakaki? These two have wisely chosen to ally themselves with me, Terror of Death. No way! It was well worth the trouble of opening this tournament, if just to hear your pitiful voice right now. <laughs> Lord Sakaki. What is it, Emperor? I'd like you to repeal Haseo's disqualification. What? He's befouled this honorable arena. I'll defeat him myself. There's no way someone who's drunk with false power could even come close to defeating me. Hmm. Very well. A well-planned scenario must be flexible. The terror of death, betrayed by a former comrade and beaten pitifully. <laughs> yes, it will be wonderful! What an unexpected development! However, you realize you may not have to do anything, don't you? After all, my greatest masterpieces, the Hetero Trio, are to be their opponents for the finals. <laughs> Aren't you looking forward to the finals, Terror of Death? I'll beat you to a pulp once and for all! So that you never dare defy me again! <laughs> Look at all the irony going on in that tournament right there. Look at look at all of the irony. All of it. Uh, uh, I don't even know if I want that. Oh, man. I really don't think I need that. So. I don't know. It's, it's, all, it's all of the irony in there. Like Haseo, they say Haseo is drunk on a false power. What about Taihaku? They say Haseo is playing hacked and cheating. But what about Takaki? It's, it's all of the irony because it's all fucking whatever. Anyways, <laughs> that'll be the end of this episode. So, thanks everybody for watching. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.